What's up everyone? I'm back and better and today's just a vlog about um, life just to have a chat with you all so um, um, so my main focus is mental health and studying because I didn't do so well at my last school um, I don't know, I just, I think I was just being, you know, coddled over too many times. Like, I was, what I mean by this is I was getting too much help than I was supposed to be getting because uh, they had the special needs space there. And um, I didn't like it because I didn't feel like I was a part of the whole entire place. But when, it, when I started college, it was overwhelming. And um, normally when you're anxious, right, you get a, a um, funny feeling in your stomach. That's just a normal indication. For me, I personally didn't get that. And um, I was really tired and my head was just like over the clouds. It was just off the place. Like I wasn't grounded or anything. It just felt awful. I had concentration issues. And um, it wasn't until... Monday this week, I went to the doctors for an emergency appointment because my anxiety got really bad. I knew that I already have this this um condition. I'll call it condition. It's also a mental as well as a mental health condition, and um, I need like you know meds to help it stop because otherwise. I can't take good care of myself. And this is not like, it's not only just calls from school, but it's from childhood and changes because I had to deal with a lot. And I mean, I mean, my main, I mean, my aim is to just do well in mental health, just try and jog like on the weekends during the day, not at night because way well well I used to do sports like I used to do athletic I used to be like um used to do running and sprinting I stopped doing that because I was forced to do it I didn't choose to do it I was forced to do it my mum wanted me to do it and there was another reason why was because I wasn't doing enough physical education at my high school because I was in an alternative group Yes, I was in that group. I had no choice to go in the other one. They wouldn't let me. And I went into the mainstream room and I just felt awkward because of what other people think because I hadn't been around f long enough. And I want, I could have moved schools, but that never happened. Oh, well. But, I mean, I mean, I don't do vigorous exercises. That just builds up my anxiety. So I just do jogging until I get better. So it's just like back to basics. And, um, yeah, so, um, I'm just chilling, just trying to get my focus back because I've tried almonds from an internet suggestion. I found a well teen stuff, it's like some just normal tablets you take when you have a meal and I'm on some medication, which I won't go into detail about because that's pretty personal, but, um, yeah, so, um, I'm just like, I mean, my room's changed slightly, so I've turned my bed around, my TV's, like, not at a higher level anymore, so it's, like, not on the shelf anymore, it's too much lower down, but it's just, I need to get my concentration back so I'm able to, like, watch TV more and enjoy myself, because it just actually sucks, because over those weeks, even months, or should I should I say, I could I don't really watch much, like from people normally would. It's like my mind was gone, just disappeared. And what I need to do is to get out more, and um, just don't sit around too much. I guess I'm not lazy, but. I think I was just overdoing things. Just try not to overdo things. And yeah, it's going to be hard, but I guess it's worth paying off. And um, 
yeah, so that's just what I like to say. Um, hope you enjoyed watching this. And, um, yeah, hope you have a good, um, good time or whatever, because I'm just going to try and get back on track. So, yeah, I'll see you soon.